Developing news this afternoon, Nate Josiah's new superintendent may be resigning from his post at tonight's school board meeting. He's the husband of the embattled elementary school principal right now who's being investigated in relationship to a sexual assault case. KETK's Lauren Margolis is live in Natchez with more about what some parents are saying. Lauren. Neil Casey, Randy Snyder is expected to announce his resignation here at Natchez High School. The matter is on the agenda for tonight's school board meeting, something many parents say they are relieved about. Snyder is the husband of Kim Snyder, principal of the Natchez Elementary School. She was charged back in February with tampering with evidence and oppression related to a sexual assault case of a minor. The case did not directly involve her, but did affect someone she knows. Past meetings have left parents frustrated after the school board chose not to take action against Snyder, believing a big reason they haven't is because of her marriage to the superintendent. Because that'll be one step, one power step gone. You know, and Kim won't be able to uh, see, I mean, she won't be able to hide under the covers of Randy anymore, you know, because whenever they voted to keep her on, on, uh, the board didn't want to vote, so they put it off on Randy. And of course, that's his wife. That's why he voted for her to stay. Parents say they feel it's unfair her husband has a say in the decision to keep Snyder in her position at the elementary school. Earlier this year, the school board voted to extend Snyder's contract until June of 2023. Tonight's meeting is set to start in just half an hour at 630. And Kim Snyder has another court appearance on May 28th in Anderson County. Live in Natchez, Lauren Margolis, KTK News.